Josh, 3-0 win tonight over one of our nearest title rivals in Tadcaster Albion. What did you make of that performance? Yeah, outstanding to be honest. I've just told the lads that. Um, I think in the first half there wasn't much in the game. Um, but it was ruthless. Uh, Charlie took his goal great and then a great delivery on like right at half time from Max and he put it on a plate for Andy and he finished it well. So um, first half it was tight but we're coming at 2-0. And, uh, and I think in the second half we come out, we defended well. Um, I can't really remember them having too many chances. And um, the chance that we did have, Prince showed a bit of composure, picked out Max. Um, and he was unlucky, but it was a definite handball. And Charlie, again, been brilliant all night. Uh, and he got his two goals. Yeah, I was just going to talk about Charlie. He's been in good goals going form in front of goal recently. Uh, led the line well tonight. How well did you think he played? Yeah, I've just said that to him. I thought he was brilliant um, for a full 90. Um, when, when a team is so good, you don't really want to pick out individuals. But tonight, like you said, I think Charlie led the line great. He won um majority of, head, of his headers. Sorry. Um, he allowed players to come in from midfield and the, the wide lads. And also, when he didn't, for instance, win it, he put the centre-half off and they were, they were knocking it down into areas where we were getting on most second balls. So, yeah, I think he was... Um, as a personal performance, he was he was brilliant. Three goals is always pleasing going forward, but Tadcaster had a lot of the ball second half. But like you say, he didn't really create too much. How much of that was down to our defence staying firm and keeping him out? Yeah, I kind of said that at half time. I think um, the the ball that was maybe doing us was like the long straight fifty yard ball where all it needed was a bit of communication for the from the full backs, the two centre halves, organising in front. And I think, like you say, they did have a lot of the ball again in the second half, but. I think defensively, as, as, as a unit, we was much tighter um, and for me we were a lot more effective um, and we looked solid all night and then we broke and, and we made it count on the counter. So I think today's win moves us 14 points clear at the top of the league. First team atop top at the moment, ladies are top, under 17 to top. How important is it to really instil that winning mentality? Yeah, again, I've just, I've just repeated that exact same things. Um, the football club from right at the top are, are winners. Um, and that's what I want um, with my lads in the 21s and tonight I think they proved that from minute one um, we had that mentality that positivity in it, positivity in this sorry I don't even know if that's a word but um, we, we were we were really on the front foot and you could see the lads really wanted it and had it between the teeth so yeah like I say it's a mentality that's spreading hopefully the whole way out through the club with it, like you say the ladies the 21s and also the 17s and, and the rest down so yeah it's and, brilliant. and now being so far ahead of the top of the league does that bring with it a different challenge to keep that same mentality you've just been talking about yeah because the next game now is the most important one um, tonight we've put in a strong performance but we've got to take that performance and put it into next week um, and as long as they do that I'm sure that we'll come out with a positive result thank you brilliant cheers lads